Food First Information and Action Network, Wikipedia Audio Introduction FIAN International, formerly, Food First Information and Action Network, was founded in 1986 as the first international human rights organization to advocate for the realization of the right to food and nutrition. Holding a consultative status with the United Nations Economic and Social Council, FIAN is active in more than 50 countries, through national sections and SEEDS groups, which account for 25 of these, as well as individual members and international networks. With no religious or political affiliation dictating its work, FIAN International exposes violations of people's right to food and related rights wherever they may occur and stands up against undue and oppressive practices that prevent people from feeding themselves. By holding governments accountable, FIAN International strives to secure people's access to and control over natural resources and means of subsistence, crucial to ensure a life of dignity now and for future generations. Nutrition, as an inherent component of the right to food, and a fundamental act of food sovereignty, remains a core objective in FIAN's work. As the struggle against gender discrimination and other forms of exclusion is an integral part of its mission, FIAN works with and in favor of the most marginalized and affected groups, its vision is of a world free from hunger, in which every woman, man, boy and girl can fully enjoy their right to food, as laid down in the Universal Declaration of Human Rights and other international human rights instruments. FIAN International's Secretariat is based in Heidelberg, Germany and Geneva, Switzerland. Organizational Structure FIAN is an international membership-based organization. FIAN's institutional members are its national sections which are legal entities in their own right and have their own membership and elected decision-making bodies. Current sections of FIAN can be found in some 25 countries, for updates look at worldwide. The overall mission, vision, and the strategy of FIAN is defined and revised by the International Council, and represented by delegates of the sections who meet once every three years. The IC elects the International Executive Committee headed by the President, which supervises the implementation of FIAN's strategic plans. The IEC meets biannually to review and strategize FIAN programs, methods, and budgets. The operative working unit being in charge of the execution of FIAN's programs is its International Secretariat located in Heidelberg and Geneva, and coordinated by the Secretary General. FIAN International's Work FIAN uses various working tools to achieve the realization of the right to adequate food. Casework and Interventions At international fact-finding missions, FIAN identifies and addresses human rights violations. FIAN interviews people threatened or affected by violations of their right to food and verifies the facts of a situation. Face-to-face -face contacts to local counterparts are established and serve as a basis for trustful cooperation. On request of those affected, FIAN reacts quickly, analyzes the case and mobilizes members and supporters worldwide to send out urgent action protest letters. Violations are also followed up in long-term casework by local FIAN action groups. In close cooperation with the affected communities, FIAN persistently approaches the responsible authorities and identifies breaches of right to food obligations. FIAN's analysis is based on the International Covenant on Economic, Social and Cultural Rights as interpreted in the UN General Comments, in particular General Comment 12 on the right to adequate food.
existing recourse mechanisms and legal remedies under national and international human rights law are applied to provide redress to the victims. Lobby and Advocacy Reliable contacts and networks, a sound documentation of cases and two decades of experience provide a solid basis for effective lobbying and advocating the right to food. FIAN holds states, international institutions, and private actors accountable at the national and international levels. The right to food guidelines adopted by the FAO in 2004 is one of the tools FIAN uses to monitor states' right to food policies. FIAN tries to improve the existing right to food protection system and to establish new instruments. Intense follow-up work strives to secure the effective implementation of existing instruments, making the right to food politically and judicially enforceable everywhere for everyone. Information and Education Targeted information campaigns and awareness raising on the right to food are at the core of FIAN's work to empower social movements and non-governmental organizations to hold states accountable for violations of the right to food, to clarify for governments and other duty bearers the content and implementation needs of their obligations, and to motivate supporters from civil society to join action against human rights violations. The systematic information gathered from more than 400 individual cases over the past two decades is analyzed and fed into various professional publications. Impact FIAN was involved prominently in the development of the Human Rights Protection System, for instance in the strengthened procedure of states and parallel reporting on economic, social and cultural human rights in the UN Human Rights System, the elaboration of the UN General Comment No. 12 on the right to food in 1999 as the most authoritative legal interpretation of the right to food in international law and the adoption of the Voluntary Guidelines on the Right to Food by the FAO member. States in 2004 FIAN's commitment was awarded internationally. Public Eye on Davos, Positive Award, in 2006, FIAN International together with two partners won the Public Eye on Davos, Positive Award which is given every year on the occasion of the World Economic Forum in Davos, for their commitment in favor of the rights of workers of the Mexican tire factory Yucati. Silver Rose Award, in 2005, two staff members of the FIAN section Germany received the Silver Rose Award for their commitment for the rights of workers in the flower industry the participation in the development of the International Code of Conduct for the production of cut flowers and its successful implementation in the framework of the flower label program. Face It Act Now campaign, http colon slash slash www.face-it-act-now.org Urgent Actions http colon slash slash fian dot org slash cases slash letter hyphen campaigns publications http colon slash slash fian dot org slash resources slash documents slash others